Welcome back to Andrew Jean Cleaning. Today I'm going to show you two of my favorite methods for removing hard water stains on glass and shower doors and basically any hard water stain that could be in your bathroom. And at the end I'm going to show you two tips and tricks that I would recommend that you use so that you do not have to do what I'm going to show you hardly ever after we get through it here today. The first thing that I'm going to show you here is some Barkeeper's Friend. Now I have used this in previous videos on headlights, my van window, and this works awesome. However, some of you have tried this method, and if you hear pounding outside, I apologize. I'm at my parents' house and they are getting some construction outside. Now, some of you have told me, I've done Barkeeper's Friend and it works to some extent here, but doesn't entirely. So I'm gonna show you a backup plan uh, that my director recommended to me. So I'm just gonna take some of this here on the towel. And this makes it so shiny. A little goes a long way. So we're gonna do up here, and then I'm gonna take you down to the bottom because there's a ton of soap scum. Now when you first apply this, it's kind of cakey, a little bit like toothpaste, but not as much. Toothpaste is another option as well. But once you get it scrubbed in there really well, it's gonna be so, so shiny and helping remove that soap scum. Now, let me go to the outside here, because you can see there's a ton of dust here as well. We'll just wipe that away. Nothing's worse than having a really beautiful shower, but then you have all the soap scum and hard water that has accumulated on there. Let's go back inside. And again, I have a product here I'm gonna show you here in a second that I doubt you've seen before. Many of you probably haven't. At least I was brand new to the product. Look at that, it just shines it right up. You guys, look it. So good. Now you'll notice there can be, it looks like somewhat of a little bit of a film, but we're gonna let it sit for a minute and it disappears all on its own. So I'm just rubbing in circular motion, so give Barkeeper's Friend a try. That's what I would do first and foremost if you wanna get those hard water spots off glass doors or anywhere in your shower. It's looking so good. Okay, we're gonna come back to this because you can kind of see where I've been wiping. Trust me, you guys, trust me. I've tried it all when it comes to hard water. In fact, in the description box, I have a whole playlist about how to remove hard water for your toilet. Okay, can you see it in here? And up in here? Yep, yep. Let's get down in here a little bit. Again, some Barkeeper's Friend. I've done this with lemon and baking soda. I have a whole video on that as well. And that works really well. But again, some of you have really hard water and it does not come up. So let's get this side. We'll do this side with the Barkeeper's Friend, a good portion of these hard water spots. And then we'll move to the other side with a product that is super exciting. I'm gonna go to this side here, clean it up. I wanna show you this all live and on camera so you can see for yourself. Here we go. Just wiping those right off. See how nice that is? Yes. So good. Let me know in the comment box below. Have you tried Barkeeper's Friend for glass? I know it's not the typical use for it, but I absolutely love it. So once the Barkeeper's Friend has fully dried, and if you wanna shine it up just a little bit more, I do like to use just a little vinegar that I have in here. I love vinegar. And then take a microfiber towel or paper towel, whatever you like to clean with, and then you can just sparkle it up even more with the vinegar. The Barkeeper's Friend really helps remove the hard water stains, and then the vinegar just really shines it up even better. So let's move on to the next product that professionals use when they clean shower doors. My director, and I've actually did a whole video about cleaning the taps with this product here, which is super, super cool. But my director had a professional come clean our shower doors, and this is what he used, my friend. This is what he used. Steel wool. I got these on Amazon. This big pack was like $4, and it's the 0000. zero, zero, zero. And you can use this on windows, you can use this basically on anything. So let's get in here where we have some tough on hard water stains that will not come up. Now you do wanna use some sort of glove per recommendation of the package. So we can see some marks, you see this right in here? Look at that. 
get in there with these little steel wool and just rub in circular motions. This works amazing and it does not damage the glass. If professional glass cleaners are using this, well, you better believe I'm going to be using it too. So, so cheap. So I'm going to rub in circular motions. You can see it's already coming up. I got some more right in here. You see that? These little steel wool pads are absolutely amazing. And then I would just take my microfiber towel and just kind of wipe up. Let's get the opposite side here of the door. You can see right, let's see if the camera can pick it up. Right here. Let me shut the door here. There we go. Ooh, there's a big one right here. Yes. I didn't even wet this. I just am doing it dry. Let's move down to the bottom because this is where a lot of the hard water does accumulate. Oh, I see one more spot I want to get here. <laughs> I mean, this is addicting. You could like go to town all day with this. I do prefer this method over the barkeeper's friend because the barkeeper's kind of leaves a tiny bit of this sort of residue that takes a while to fully dry and then it goes away. But barkeeper's friend is nice too. Okay, see down it. Look at all this, you guys. Look at this. You can see the pad right now. Yes. Okay, I'm just going to flip it over here. We're going to go in circular motions. And we're going to get all of these hard water stains off. They get stuck on there and you cannot get up. The microfibers are so fine on the steel here that they don't cut the glass, but they just pick up the hard water. And down in here, I see in here. Circular, oh, it looks so good. Watch, okay, can you see right here? It's so hazy, watch this. So good. See the difference here to here? Move down a little bit more. I got two little tricks up my sleeve for you as well. Uh, and this part, this gets really disgusting as well. This comes off, you can see it's turning pink from uh, water staying stuck in there. That's on the other side of the shower, back in here. Ooh, here's some good ones. I think these might be on the other side though. Yeah, let's move over there. Some accumulation of stuff out here. Did you see that? I'm hardly applying any pressure either. So good. Sometimes it's hard for the camera to pick it up because of the glass. Now, once you have your shower doors all free of soap scum and hard water, get yourself a squeegee such as this and something to attach it. So that way, every time you shower, you can just come in and squeegee it so that you can help prevent the buildup of that hard water and that soap scum. So this is definitely gonna save you time if you just give it like 15 seconds to quickly wipe down. The other thing that is super helpful, I have been using this product since I was in high school. It's called Clean Shower, and you spray this around on your tile anywhere in your shower after you're done, and it's gonna help prevent the buildup of soap scum. So you can do shower, tile, and tub. Um, what's really great about this is let me show you it says daily use prevents the buildup of soap scum hard water and other stains no more scrubbing no bleach or ammonia fresh clean scent let me know if you've tried this i absolutely love this once you've cleaned it all up you are wiping down and squeegeeing if you have glass shower doors like this and you spray some of this you should hardly ever have to do a deep clean of your shower. Maintenance is key. It's kind of like your whites and you want to keep them whiter longer. You have to have a whitening routine in place. If they go far too long, it's really hard to get it back to its original shine, just like a shower. And when the time comes to really fully clean your shower out, you probably don't want to spend a whole day doing it. I am all about making things easier for you, keeping them economical. I appreciate you so much for being here. I'm going to show you these products one more time. Barkeeper's friend, shine it shine up your glass like so and then these steel wool 
if you have some hard water soap scum that is not coming off your glass or your taps. Those videos are linked in the description box below. Hit me up on Instagram at Andrew Jean Co. I teach women how to turn their passion into profit. And this cleaning channel is one way that I do that. And I will see you, my friend, in the next one.